Welcome friends. In this video, we will learn how to convert XLS file to XLSB format in c -sharp.net using aspos.cells API. We assume, you have already watched our previous video in which we taught you how to install aspos.cells using NuGet in Visual Studio. If not, we have given the link of it inside the video description, so you can watch it from there. It is very easy to convert XLS to XLSB using aspos.cells. You can do it with only two lines of code. Let's open our input directory where our sample XLS file is present. Here is our XLS file. Before converting it to XLSB format, let's view it in Microsoft Excel application. We have already set up everything. We have created the console application project and added the reference of most recent version of aspos.cells DLL using NuGet. You can view our former video that teaches how to create console application project and install aspos.cells using NuGet. We have provided its link in our video description. Let's understand the sample code step by step and then execute it. As the comment says, this is the directory path where our input XLS file is present and where output XLSB file will be created after the execution of this code. In this line, we are loading input XLS file that we viewed earlier in Microsoft Excel application inside the aspos.cells workbook object. In this line, we are simply saving aspos.cells workbook object in XLSB format. This will convert our XLS file to XLSB format. If you want to execute entire code at once, please press F5 or Ctrl plus F5. Or you can execute it step by step by pressing F10. Let's press F10 and execute it step by step. We are done executing the code. Let's check the output directory where aspos.cells have generated the converted XLSB file. Here is our converted XLSB file. Let's double click to view it in Microsoft Excel. The evaluation warning sheet is here because we have not set the license inside the code. Once, you will set the license, it will be gone. For more information, Please visit ASPOS or check video description. Here you can see, XLS has successfully been converted to XLSB format. That's it. Thanks for watching this video. Please do not forget to watch video description because sometime we share important information inside the description for example, sample code, sample files, output files, and links to related articles and various resources. Goodbye.